I'm just gonna say it right now. The stoppage was 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 trash. Okay, Kenny Porter stopped the fight after Sean Porter, his son, got dropped for a second time. Sean Porter couldn't continue that fight. At least let your son go out on his shield. Don't stop the fight like that. It just pissed me off the fact that he stopped the fight like that. Okay? Because Sean Porter could have still continued, in my opinion. First of all, Sean Porter was doing amazing against Terrence Crawford. Sean Porter was winning multiple rounds against Terrence Crawford. That was a really competitive fight. And Sean Porter is known for having an incredible chin and being able to withstand punches and going the distance with guys. You know, he did not look like he was out out, 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 out on his feet and bouncing around the ring and, and, and looked like he was going to get knocked out. He, in my opinion, would have recovered and probably the fight would have gone the distance. You know, he wasn't like dazzled. He wasn't like, uh, you know, all over the place looking like Deontay Wilder after the, the, the second fight with Tyson Fury. He was still on his feet. I just did not like that stoppage. All right. I did not like that stoppage. I did not like that stoppage at, at all. I think it was a trash stoppage. Come on, man. That fight was so close. At least let it go the distance. You literally had like six minutes or probably less, like five minutes before that fight end ended. I think it would have gone the distance. You know, and it probably it could have it could have it could have been a draw. Who knows? Because that was such a close fight. But congrats to Terrence Crawford for finally fighting a guy who's at least legit at welterweight. It was the most competitive. This was the most competitive fight in Terrence Crawford's entire career. His entire career, this was the most difficult fight he's ever had. Because he's been fighting low-quality bums for, for, for a while. So this is the first time he's fought somebody who's actually legit. And he gave him a run for his money. I thought he was losing that fight. Before he, he, he knocked him down... I thought he was losing that fight. I was th I was screaming at the t at the TV like, "Bro, let your hands go! What you doing? You let your hands go! You're losing this fight! You're giving this fight away!" So finally, he decided to let his hands go, and he won some rounds. And then he ended up dropping, uh, you know, Sean Porter. Once Sean Porter started getting sloppy and tired, you know, I just did not like the stoppage. Okay, I felt like the fight could have continued. I felt like. He did a disservice to his son, uh, Kenny Porter, w by stopping it so early like that. Anyway, that's all I have to say. Thanks for watching. And let me know what you guys think about this uh, this fight and how you guys thought it played out.